Hi, my name is Anne Chung. I'm one of the rheumatologists here at BJC Health. Today, I just want to talk about one of the questions my patients asked me during consultation. And their question was, my inflammatory markers are low. Does that mean that my condition is um, active or inactive? And I think um, there's no simple answer to this because I guess trying to assess um, disease activity is not so simple where you can just um, get an answer from a blood test. Um, trying to ascertain disease activity includes assessing uh, patient symptoms, so the levels of pain and how they're feeling. It includes a thorough clinical examination, so looking at where the pain is generated, whether there are physical signs of um, disease such as visible joint swelling or pain on palpation. And yes, we do use blood tests to check also, but this is just one of the very many facets we look at when we consider your condition. What I haven't touched on that is also very helpful in assessing disease activity is of course imaging. So if for example um, you've been seen by your clinician and they're still not sure from listening to you, examining you and looking at your blood test whether your condition is active or inactive, they may well arrange for you to have investigations such as an x-ray, ultrasound or MRI to clarify things more. So too simple, you can't judge disease activity by a simple blood test alone. Um, we have to take all these other considerations um, into account when we try to devise the best um, therapeutic option for you.